and put on 200-year-old 3D glasses. He saw a special symbol on top of an antique painting, and the symbols point to a long-buried treasure. But before they can decipher the exact location, George's men found them, to avoid them all being caught. Cage 3 immediately split up, but Anna accidentally bumped into a passerby while leaving. The antique painting was still in George's possession, although Cage escaped George's men, but was chased by the police Jack caught on the spot. But when Jack was interrogating Cage, inadvertently let Cage see the correct use of glasses, and then the man suddenly called. He wanted Cage to hand over the glasses, so Cage decided to work with Jack to get the antique back. He decided to cooperate with Jack to get back the antique painting, under Anna's direction. Cage and George both successfully met. In order to ensure that Cage will not have any accidents, George even grabbed Cage's father to threaten him. Cage had no choice but to agree to take George to the treasure. Then they came to a church. By constantly switching lenses, Cage found the treasure is hidden in the basement of this church. Then they cracked open a special tombstone, carried out the coffin stored inside, and inside was a long tunnel. After everyone went through the tunnel, they found a tomb body spiraling down below. The wooden ladder had all rotted due to time. Fortunately there is a vertical elevator. Then several people took the elevator to the bottom of the cave. Then a secret room appeared in front of them, but there were no objects inside, and George suddenly boarded the lift. He threatened Cage to tell him where the rail treasure was hidden. Cage's father had a stroke of genius. He made up a random clue and told George. He didn't expect George to leave them here, but Cage was still convinced that the treasure was here. Then he pressed a mechanism and found a secret door. Through the secret door, they came to a secret room, but here there is still no information about the treasure. At this time, the recess on the wall caught Cage's attention. He put the pipe into the recess. He inserted the pipe handle into the lock hole. Then he gently spun a stone door that suddenly appeared. They went in immediately with excitement. What appeared in front of them were countless antiques. When Cage lit up the lighting in the chamber, more rare treasures appeared in the light of the fire, and in the distance there was a staircase to leave the place. After Cage emerged from the treasure cave, he gave the antique paintings to the police as soon as he could, and he was spared jail time. But someone had to take responsibility for stealing the antique painting, so the unlucky George became the scapegoat. Cage did not take the treasure for himself. Instead, he returned it to the country where they were originally from. He ended up living happily ever after with Anna.